You wanted to see me? I was thinking of what you said to me when we were both lost in the withering. I'm sorry if I was out of line. You're so important to the Foundation, I... I just wanted you to come back. And I did come back. Eric, you did what you had to do to pull me out of my darkness. I've sworn my life to the Foundation and its people. I was failing them. I needed to hear it. But beyond your words, your spirit is what truly brought me back. What do you mean? You're a survivor, Eric. I only knew about the steel mill. I had no idea you'd suffered through so much when you came to this country. I've suffered too. My father was murdered right in front of me. Someone shot him in the chest, mistaking him for a thief who had just robbed a bodega. I didn't know. Not many do. I only share it with people I trust. He bled out on the street. There was nothing I could do to save him. I couldn't save my mother either. I felt so powerless. You were just a child. I promised my father I would protect her. And I couldn't. Now I feel like I'm failing all over again with Faith. You tried your best to find her. It wasn't enough. I wasn't enough. That's not true. Remember what Paul Radcliffe said? Our deepest pains one day turn into our strongest armor. Eric, what we went through made you a strong healer. I know you originally joined the Foundation because of Rachel, but she doesn't see your light like I do. Don't get me wrong. She's a fine member of the Foundation, but she's not a healer like you are. When it comes to the Foundation, I need you to put your faith in me. I need to know that you're committed to helping me stop the withering over everything else. I'm sorry, Xavier, but the only reason I'm here is to find Faith. Eric, you have to face the possibility that the withering took her, but you can help other families. No, not until I save mine. I saved you from the withering, didn't I? Then I can save her too. Xavier, you're needed in the library. I'll be right there. you did back there. What are you doing here? I... I can't find my daughter. Wait. You lost your child too? I've searched everywhere. And now you're here looking for her? I... I think I'm being punished. For what? Oh God. My baby's out there with that thing. Listen. I lost my son. It's been weeks, but I'm not giving up, and you shouldn't either. Maybe we can help each other. What's her name? Your daughter. Rachel. 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 What's going on in here? Wait, where did she go? Is she here? Who? Faith? You know she's not- No! The woman! I- I just saw her and... Faith is still out there. 
And I think this is bigger than just our family. Just slow down for a second. Who is this woman? What did she say to you? Let me help you. You can't help me, Eric. Who's that? A friend of yours? I'm Detective Sandberg. I work... Detective Haugen was my partner. I'm not sure what you want to interrogate me about. I mean, I already turned myself in. I'm not here to interrogate you. New information has come to light and you are no longer a suspect in your son's disappearance. Thank God. What did you find out? I'm not at liberty to talk about it. You said Haugen was your partner. Where is she? I can't discuss all the details, but let's just say we discovered something in your case that caused the department to suspend her. Why? You'll have to ask her. In the meantime, you're free to go. Axel Pettersson. Carl. I missed you, min kjæreste. Do you know what this is? Frida Åberg. I treated her, Carl, at the hospital. What happened to her? She... she died. My God, these names. They were patients. Your patients? They were all in so much pain. There is so much suffering in this world, Carl. I can't stand it. I just want to help people end their pain. How did these people die, Mette? They weren't living. They had no hope. They were in endless anguish just waiting to die, but no one would help them. Sometimes when someone is suffering that much, someone should help them. Don't you agree? Carl, I don't think we should stay here anymore. We should leave this town, never look back. And where would we go? Tell me. When we were young, I remember you talking about wanting to sail around the world. It's not too late to do that, you know. You can still do it. And you don't have to be alone. I will be with you, if you want. It's late. I'll be in soon. For true sight, and I must be sacrificed. Eric, I don't want to talk about this. I can't just forget about it, Krista. I watched that thing drag you off into the fog. What happened? How did you get away? Krista, are you okay? Me? What about you? What about me? Right before I was... taken, you were finally starting to admit that you deserved better than Rachel. What does that have to do with anything? You still haven't answered my question. What happened out there? I don't want to talk about it. You have to talk to somebody. I can't really remember, okay? That's bullshit. Talk to me, Krista. I said no! Come on, Krista, you have to talk to someone about what happened. Just drop it, okay? I can't. Why? Because I care about you! You do? I should go. Eric, wait! Worst day of my life since my daughter died. You remember that day, Leo? The day Asta died? Olivia. There's no way anyone could forget that day. 
No. There. There isn't. You'd think they'd understand. Have a little empathy for me after 15 years. But no. They wouldn't even let me back in the building to collect my things. Great, it's you. Here to gloat? No. I'm here for answers. Why were you suspended? What did I find? They thought I wasn't impartial enough to solve your son's missing persons case. That doesn't make sense. I turned myself into you. That's what I told them. Your partner said new information came to light about Orson. What was it? They think I'm crazy. That's what came to light, okay? Why would they think that? Doesn't matter. But what does matter is that your son is probably as dead as my daughter. Don't say that. Do you even remember my daughter's name? Huh? It was Asta. And she was only six when- Oh no you don't! Get out! The hell? After you broke my tables yesterday, you're never coming in here again. I wasn't anywhere near here yesterday. Guess I'm not the only one with troubles. Wait! Astrid, tell this cron idiot that I haven't touched a glass in this place. Liar! I saw you with my own eyes. To hell with this! I'm out of here! Don't go, Brit. Let's get this sorted out. There's nothing to sort out! I won't take the blame for something I didn't do. Go fuck yourself. Brit, wait. Rachel! Rachel! <laughs> Eric? Are you okay? What are you doing out here? I was looking for you. We can't be out here. It's not safe. I can't do it anymore, Eric. I can't stay in the Foundation while Faith is out here, somewhere. Why doesn't anyone care about finding our daughter anymore? I do! I searched for her for days! I know. But it's getting more dangerous out here by the day. We have to be more careful. Think about what happened to Xavier. And Krista was attacked! You're thinking about Krista a lot lately. She's a friend. You're my wife. And I love you. Please, come back inside. I can't. I met a woman in the Withering. She was looking for her kid, too. You can't trust what you see out here. No. This was real. I know it. You can't keep going off alone. We have to work together with the Foundation if we want to find Faith. What if I told you I found a way to bring Faith back? Another ritual? It's an older text, darker than the rest of Radcliffe's writings, but it promises true sight. For a price. What kind of price? An eye. An eye? Whose eye? Does it matter? Rachel, you're scaring me. This is what it takes. How do you know that for sure? All of the rituals that we've tried so far have failed. This is different. So either get on board with this or stay out of my way. A lot of roses so far. By the time the memorial happens, you won't be able to see the fountain. Come on, let's get out of here.
heard your daughter turned herself in for murdering her kid. And now you come here? Please, I'm sorry. I meant no disrespect. No disrespect. You being here is disrespect. You need to leave. Don't listen to them. They're not worth your energy. Let's go. Something is coming. No, we need to stay here. I want to see what's happening. I said no. I need to see, please. Who's that? Her child is missing too. She was looking for her. Where? Here in town? No. Here. But not here. It's hard to explain. But I think she's connected to what happened to Orson somehow. I need to find her. It's almost like I dreamed her. But I didn't. I'm sorry. I must sound crazy to you. Not really. I have Leo accusing me of damaging his bar when I know I didn't. I don't understand why he would think that. He's either lost it or... I have. For what it's worth, I believe you. You do? I think people have their ideas about you. And they're ready to make you suffer for them. But we can't let them. Who's that? I don't know. Wait, where are you going? To find out. In order to have the true sight necessary to find faith, there must be sacrifice. We wander the earth blinded by what we can see, blind to sickness, Blind to rot, blind to the blight that consumes us. Purifier, grant me your sight. Open my mind to your vision. Da mihi visum ut invenies quad quedo. Faith, you've come back to me. Rachel, what have you done to yourself? No, it's not safe. I need to see it. Let me go. You need to let me go. No. You go out there, you'll die. Close your eyes now. No, let me see it. You 
ruined it! Your chance for what? I needed to protect you. Protect me? I can protect myself. Ava? Ava, wait! in your family. Killers! That's why I'm here, isn't it? Answer me! How could you desecrate your body like that? It was the price I'm willing to pay to get my daughter back. So where is Faith now? I don't know. All you did was open the door for the Withering to seep further into our world. Xavier, I... No, I don't want to hear it. You'll have a chance to explain yourself at the Tribunal. You have to listen to me! No, I don't have to listen to you ever again. I believed in you. I thought you were chosen to end this nightmare. But all you did was break my heart. You've made a fool of me, Rachel. Xavier, please. You should think long and hard about how you want to defend your actions. And if you even want to remain a member of this community. 